In this video, I am going to show you how to download and install Meteor Client for Minecraft Java version 1.21.11. So, let's get started. To begin, simply go to your web browser, and I will have links in the description if you need them. But here, go to your search bar and search up Meteor Client, like this. Now enter, here you'll find a website called MeteorClient.com. Click on Meteor Client here, and you'll be sent to this page right here. Now, all you have to do is scroll down, you'll find a download section here. Now, find Meteor Client here for 1.21.11, and click this button here. This will bring you to this page here, where you might have some ads, and all you have to do here is just wait a couple seconds, and on the top right corner, you have a timer here, and when it expires, click on Skip. This goes ahead and get you Meteor Client, which is the first thing we need. So, this will get us Meteor Client, and now we need to get ourselves Fabric. So to get Fabric, go to a new tab, go to your search bar, and search up Fabric Minecraft, like this. Now enter, here you'll find FabricMC.net, click on Fabric, and it'll bring you to this page. Here, go to the blue download button, and then go to the blue download for Windows button. And now you have Fabric as well. Okay, so once you have these two files here, you can close or minimize your web browser. Well, I'll close mine in this case. And then you can go to your file explorer to access your downloads folder. Here, all you have to do is simply find Fabric Installer here and double click it. And here, a installer window will show up. And all you have to do is make sure the information is correct. And then click on install. Okay, and close. And here, go ahead and open up your Minecraft launcher, because all we have to do is add Meteor Client to the, our mods folder. So basically here, all you have to do is go to installations on the top of the website here, then you have to hover over Fabric Loader here, and go to the folder icon. Here, all you have to do is find the mods folder here, and double click it. Once you're here, go to downloads, and select Meteor Client. Now copy it and go to the top left arrow to go back to the previous folder, and then click on paste, and that's it. You copy paste it, meet your client to download Minecraft mods, and now all you have to do is go back to the Minecraft launcher. Once you're here, all you have to do is go to play, make sure Fabric is your selected version, and then click on play. And here you have to wait for Minecraft to open up automatically. So that is one thing you have to do. And then once Minecraft is gonna open up, we can go ahead and actually try out Meteor Client. So here is Minecraft, and then all we have to do here is wait for it to load. Here we see that we have Meteor Client, so this is a good sign, it means the mod actually works here. And then we can go to a single player world, a server or a realm. Of course these are multiplayer, so using this is of course at your own risk. But we'll go ahead and go to a single player world here of course, and go ahead and actually try out Meteor Client and how to activate it and stuff like that. So basically this is a world loading. Okay, so once we are in a world like this, we can go to our right shift key. So that is the key which is on the right. And it should look something like this. So once you have the menu, we can go ahead and move these around. You can do things like that. And you can for example go ahead and activate some Fulbright. You can do some free cam. So basically just leave your body like this. You can go ahead and deactivate this. You can right click to have more options and escape to escape that. You can add traces to go ahead and actually see where things are going. You can right click this and go ahead and select different entities depending on what you want. So, for example, we have a chicken. If we only want to trace on chickens, here the green ones here are all the chickens we can go ahead and actually find. So, this should be one right here. That's pretty cool. You can go ahead and go to Right shift again, we can do kill over, we can do hitboxes here to expand hitboxes. As you can see, just we're not, we're not really aiming at it, but we still end up aiming, that's pretty cool. And yeah, so there's way, way more things to this, but that is basically the basics on it, like how do we get Meteor Client for this version, that is how we do that. So yeah, in today's video, I showed you how to download and install Meteor Client for Minecraft Java version. 1.21.11. So if you liked this video, make sure to like and subscribe, and see you for the next one.
Bye.